Hi, this is Jack Bourne, founder of AW Pro Tools. And in this short video, I'm going to show you how to use the delayed action smart links. This is an incredibly powerful feature. You need to have the professional account or higher in order to use it. But let's go ahead and dive in. You access it by going over to the advanced logic section over on the left. And then you click on the delayed action tab right up top here. So it's real simple. It's only going to take a few seconds for me to show you how this works. What you're going to do is you're going to choose from a drop down of smart links that you've already created. So step one, create a smart link. As you probably know, a smart link will move someone to a different list when they click a link or copy them or add a tag or a combination of those things. So once you've created a smart link, now what we want to do is we want to say, OK, instead of running that smart link, the second that they click that link, what if we wanted to wait a specific amount of time and trigger it at exactly a specific time? So one reason why you might want to do this would be that if you wanted the first message on that list B that they're being moved to or copied to, if you want that to go out at a specific time, then this would be a great way to do that. So let's go ahead and I'm just going to choose one. And so I'll just choose test of step three. That's the name of that smart link. OK, it's just a demo that I set up for another video. So now I'm going to choose the time zone. Now there's a whole bunch of different time zones and you can search from the top, but the most common ones are up top here to make it easy and convenient for you. So I'll choose US Eastern just for this demo. So for the time zone, so when someone clicks this link, what I want to have happen is I want to have it wait uh, one day and then trigger it at, let's say, 7 a.m. Eastern time. Now, if I wanted to do PM, I just keep sliding this over. And this is in what's sometimes known as military time. So midnight would be uh, all the way over here, 2359. So if I just move the top one, that, those are the hours. This would be noon, and this is 1 PM, etc. So let's send it out at 7 AM Eastern time, and I'll click Save. OK, so now that has been saved. Now, what I do is in order to use this, I click on View for the name that I just created. So here's the name of the smart link and it's showing that this is delayed and we click on view. So I actually use this instead of the smart link. And so this says trigger after one days at seven o'clock in the time zone America forward slash New York. And that's programmatically how Eastern is, is shown. And so what I would do is I would use this the same way that I use a smart link, but rather than them being moved or copied or, or tagged uh, right away, it would actually happen at a specific time after a certain number of days, in this case one day, at 7 a.m. in a specific time zone. So I just copy and paste this into my email and I send that out. It will still send someone immediately to the same landing page uh, set up for the smart link. But now the actual action behind the scenes is going to run at a time that you decide.